And aside from COVID, there's another health danger for UC Davis students, one that's easy to see just by walking through campus. I mean, it's not appealing. We don't want this. As students and staff return to UC Davis this week, they're being warned about a toxic substance lurking in the campus waterways. The danger, a layer of green slime covering this mile long portion of Puda Creek that runs from downtown Davis through the center of campus. And there's just like algae like sitting on the water. The creek has no natural flow. All the water comes from storm runoff and discharges from the water treatment plant. When you have virtually stagnant water, you get a lot of algae growth, particularly surface algae as well as cyanobacteria. That's the toxic organism that can cause serious health problems. These hazard signs have now been posted warning people to avoid exposure and keep their pets out of the water. It tends to happen in the summer after we We've had a long dry period and a long hot period. But there's hope on the horizon. The campus just received a $5 million state grant to improve water quality by installing a series of weirs and recirculation pumps that will prevent algae blooms. This project is going to transform this waterway. A portion of the project is already complete and they're seeing success. It does aerate the water that goes over the weirs. And so oftentimes we find fish that gather right there at the weir because the higher oxygen water makes it easier for them to breathe. It's an effort to enhance this wildlife habitat and keep it safe for people and their pets. Total restoration costs are expected to be around $8 million and it should be all finished by 2023.